What's up everyone, Jammy Say here, back again with some more WWE Champions content, and it is week 5 of the Winter of Wonder 2 month MLC, and it's time for Talent Up once again, so we are back, and we are ready to make some more moves. Now, the last Talent Up I did was a bit more reserved, this one we are going a bit bigger. I have got some 6 star silver moves to make. First one up is the one I've been holding off on for a little bit. Not because I wanted to, but because tokens held me back. And we have got to just quickly chuck in a couple of moves for TP. And then Farouk is going to be our first big move of the day to 6 star silver. So get those two done. And this is a move I am definitely excited about because I really enjoy using Farouk. His finisher damage is ridiculous. Ridiculous. So he is always going to be a six star silver shape. So there we go. That is first move done. Farouk to six silver. Now, second move I want to make is not a six silver, but there is a link to it. And it is Acolyte Bradshaw. Farouk's tag partner. Obviously, I, I got him earlier in the month. And now we are going to start making moves on him. Because I want Bradshaw to join Farouk at 6 star silver eventually. He's currently at 5 star silver. So we've got a few levels to go. But he is absolutely going to join in there. So let's get these moves equipped and leveled up. The Bradshaw for one is extremely useful for boss battle. In the right situation, he does power gems, he's got multiplies. Okay, go. One more move in. Sweet. And that is Bradshaw. To five star gold. Now, I may come back and revisit Bradshaw later, depending where we are with the talent up, but I don't think I'm going to have the allowance to take him six star silver today. So, if that is the uh, sorry, six star bronze, even not six silver. <coughs> so, if that is the case, oh, in actual fact, I can take him bronze anyway because I don't have enough bronze tokens. So, yeah, we will not be revisiting Bradshaw today. But, yeah, next talent up, that is definitely a move I want to make. Okay, on to our next one. In actual fact, she is right there. Zombie Becky. We have her levels maxed. We just need to throw TP into her. And she is also going to go 6 star silver. Another new newish character for me that I really enjoy using. So getting her to silver is going to be a big help. Just have to get through the boring bit. Which, as, <coughs> as always, I appreciate everyone sticking around while we go through this. Uh, 
I mean, that is a beastly move, doing 5 mil damage to your opponent and to yourself. But then, when you've got this right here, that allows you to make leech gems... And you can heal yourself. Works out quite nicely. So that's that one. Do the bite. So we are now making 30 gems into leech gems. And if your health is under 75%, you increase your blue MP by 5, which automatically basically refills the bite for the next turn. As well as the leg cleaver. So yeah, you do that and then blow up the board. So if you've got this one equipped, you can do a 3x7 or you can have that one for the 25 random gems into black so that refills itself. Either way you can do it and you can break your leech gems and refill your own health. So... I just did that, and I didn't even evolve her. Too busy chatting her up. Where'd she go? There she is. So we can now enhance Becky into six star silver. Plenty of tokens to do it. Uh, sorry, plenty of shards to do it. Not so much on tokens. Wonderful, another female to my six star silver army. Okay, another female we need to work up this time is Nikita Lyons. So I said in my last talent up video that Nikita was being given a bit of a rocket boost because I made a realization that I am distinctly lacking in modern tech females. So, Nikita is getting the boost. Because at 6 star, her triple black is a very good moveset. So, let's get these done. Get her up to 6 star. That one. Spin and heel kick. I must admit, while they are very situational, her two red moves for stealing MP are definitely useful at times. Obviously, like I said, they're situational. But I've used them in a few places and they definitely help. If you're trying to keep your opponent's MP down. So, that being said. Don't need much in the way of shards for her. Because we have uh, 3.8k for her anyway. So it's only 200k to convert. Sorry, 200 to convert, not 200k. And Nikita goes to 6 star bronze. Nice. So with that done, let's go and take a look where we are with the talent up. So in solo and few prep talent up. We are 10 out of 12, 277 million. So we are aiming at 351. So we've got more in the bag to do still. I have two more moves that I definitely want to make. So the first one is another new recruit of mine. Is Bianca Belair, Tough Est. <clears throat> got her from the bags last month. And now is the time to start moving her up. So we are going to take her to 6 star silver right now. Uh, I would like to have taken her 
gold, but unfortunately because I made the Becky move, I'm going to run out of tokens. So this is going to be a little bit of a slower build than I would have initially wanted for her, but all the same, she is still coming up. Okay. Get these three done. There's one more to chuck in. And I tell you, when I get her up, I am going to enjoy using her because I have been tranced by her so many times, it is unbelievable. And last move. There we go. And Bianca to five star silver. Wonderful. And then that leaves us with one more planned move, which is another six star silver. And this is one that I am, even now, honestly, still trying to decide which one to do. Because I want to take a trick to silver, and I'm in two minds. Do I take Johnny Knoxville, or do I take Dirty Dom? And... Honestly, I'm more swayed towards Knoxville. So we're going to do Knoxville. That alone has just maxed the talent up. Uh, oops, no, more moves to do. Equip the two black moves. Max those out. And then Knoxville can go to six star silver. Wonderful. So that's Knoxville to Silver. Dom will follow at some point. But yeah, I just think Knoxville for me is the one I enjoy using more at the moment. So yeah, I think that's probably why he's taken, taken the lead in terms of who goes first. So that being said, that is our talent up done we are up to 7.1 million now and let's have a look let's sort this by rarity obviously flip it upside down because for some reason you put it by rarity and it puts the lowers first so we are what's that 16 21 six star silvers now uh, future plans, we're probably looking, I need to get to Goldberg at some point. Uh, I want to bring, uh, Balor up. Uh, Cody, Nikita, definitely to follow. Seth and KO, Cena up here, probably all will come at some point. And then there's also Sammy and Dom and my new addition in Grayson Waller. Uh, Shinsuke, yeah, I got plenty of options to bring up. I got Priest down here. <clears throat> yeah, plenty to do. Rosie down here. I got Kali. Lots of options for future talent ups, all depending on tokens. So that being said, we are done with today's video. Uh, thank you for watching. Appreciate the uh views as always and
I hope you enjoyed it. So please like, share and subscribe. All the good stuff. Keep jamming and have a nice day.